Can I ask you something? Do you think that you've chosen how to live your life? Do you feel like that there's a you that controls how you live? Are you following? Do you feel like you're the writer that's writing the story of your life and that that you somehow has freedom of will and is consciously making decisions like who you marry or whether you have kids? Do you really believe that you are deciding to do those things? Uh, yes. Hey, buddy. Today was a rough one. <laughs> this little movie that I'm making. I cannot hold that much blood in my mouth, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously, this is not working out. It is a bit of a piece of crap. And I don't think I'm gonna have time to fix it before it's too late. Okay, cut. We need to see... You want to grab some real food tonight? How she's decided to live her life. Do you think there could be something else involved here? Something beyond us? Whisper something filthy, please. I think I'm falling in love with you. Filthier. There's something about you. You are somehow even stranger than I was expecting. I'm sorry. I've just been in kind of a weird place for the last... 38 years. I'm creating a DNA editing algorithm that will make human beings immortal. Sure. But I just left the uh, Chinese underground biotech company that I was working for, and I took my genomic programming with me, and now uh, they're threatening to kill me to get it back. What kind of medications are you on? You said something earlier. Your friend stopped by and was able to save you because your door was open overnight, even though you always lock it. I also always, always lock my door. When I got home the other day, it was unlocked. When I opened it, I noticed that someone had rigged it so it would stay open. You make it sound like we're all just, like, robots. Yeah, we are. We absolutely are. And acknowledging that fact means letting go of the things we care most about. Feelings of love, hate, spirituality, morality, pride, guilt, regret. How can any of it mean anything when no one is actually in control? And facing this means looking at life in very new, very uncomfortable ways. I'm inviting you to do that.